Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new to my channel, I am Keys Budget and Planning. And this will also go on my vlogs page. So a lot of you guys may be familiar with me being called All Things Key or Simply Key. So today we're gonna talk about our new family member that we have. A lot of you probably already seen him on Instagram and Facebook, and plus he got his own Instagram. But I just wanted to introduce you to the new member of the family since he'll probably be in the vlogs here um, from here on out. Now, before I show y'all the new family member, first of all, I got to take a deep breath. Because I've been ripping and running around my house and I'm out of breath. So, <sighs> got to get the breath back right. Okay. Um, let's start off saying um, he was a debt. Um, but he was also a graduation present, so I was willing to make that sacrifice for him. Um, and like I said, he'll definitely be on my vlogging channel, channel, and you may see him on my budget and planning channel every now and then. But I kind of try to keep that as I try to keep that on a budging, a financial aspect. I try not to bring any vlogs or anything, hauls or anything over there unless it has something to do with budget and planning. But I just wanted to introduce him on both channels. Um, he is two and a half months old. He is a Maltese, um, toy Maltese. So he's only gonna, he's not gonna get very big. And he's only gonna be, get seven pounds. He's super spoiled. I know you can hear him. He's spoiled riding already. Um, I'm talking about stroller, car seat. You probably like, do they make car seats for dogs? Of course they do. I wouldn't have bought it if they did not. So he has a car seat, he has a stroller, he has a, a doggy bag. Um, that we store when we go places. He has all his stuff in that bag. Um, he has toys. He has blankets. He has clothes. Um, the only thing we haven't put him on yet. Hey. The only thing we haven't put him on yet is snacks. Because he's such, so little. He's just two and a half months. He was born March the 17th of 2020. So he's still a little baby. So we're trying to get him on his, um, on his dry food he was on wet food due to the fact when he came to us he had a lot of complications that i did not know nothing about child but i was already in love so it was already he was already a keeper and i wasn't gonna return him um but he had a lot of complications and we took a lot of trips to the hospital let me tell you we did a lot of deworming because it was horrible but now he's better he's gained his little weight he's gaining weight he's super bad um and we're just training him and getting to know him and he's getting to know us so without further ado this is tokyo look look tokyo look tokyo 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 is a let me fix his shirt he is like i said a multi poo i'm not gonna tell y'all how much this dog was just know he wasn't cheap at all because he's full blood full bred can be in a dog show motifs. So, yeah. Um, he, that's my little baby. And his name is spelled T-O-K-E-Y-O. -E I wasn't going to name this dog Tokyo. I had th went over all kinds of names for him. But the kids insisted on be naming him Tokyo. And since they're taking part in helping me take care of him and look after him and mind yeah mind him and just do things for him i thought that it was okay for them to have a hand in naming him but he is my dog as y'all know loretta has turtles Aji did have a um yorkie but she didn't take care of the yorkie so the deal was either take care of the yorkie or i'm going to give him to a family that will because that was her dog not ours and she did not do what she was supposed to, which she admits she was not ready for a dog at the time. She just wanted him, but she wasn't ready. So I gave him to a loving family and I actually work with that family. So they tell me everything that's going on with her and she's doing really, really good. And this is my baby. Like, but it's crazy because although he's my baby, everybody has fell in love with him and everybody just loves him. Um, he's super sweet. He's super spoiled. Um, he's just amazing. Um, he's brought a lot of peace in our house. We laugh. I mean, we already know how to have fun and laugh and everything, but we laugh a lot more now and everybody's like hands on with him and 
he's just even the youngest one and he don't like nothing but what he like and if he decide he don't like it then it's a wrap but he's falling in love and he's been asking to watch him and help take care of him and stuff like that um he has on a pittsburgh steelers jersey so that's what he has on um we will be doing videos on how to maintain and take care of your fur babies. So we will be bringing that to the vlogs. I'm doing a lot of changing with my vlogs. I'm getting older now. Um, as you guys know, I'm 39. I'm getting older now. So a lot of things that I did last year, I've grown. A lot of things I've done five years ago, I've grown. You grow, you're supposed to grow every day, every year. You're not supposed to stay stagnant and stay the same. And um, I looked back at a lot of videos that I once did and I'm like, that is not, I know my channel, I'm not expecting my channel to be extremely huge, but I'm expecting it to at least have some decent numbers. And if you, if you want your family to be a family channel, a lot of things you're going to have to reinvent and revamp on your channel. And I just have decided to go in a different direction with my channel. It'll still be vlogs. It'll still be um, hauls. It'll still be all that other stuff. But I'm going to be a, like more mindful of the content that I put out there and um, more mindful in the way that I represent myself and my family and um the things that i am trying to create and do so yeah um this is tokyo he's my little baby it's about time for him to eat and i know he has to use the bathroom so oh and he's due for a haircut yes he is but i didn't want to take him to a vet or anything well he's been to a vet he has a vet but i didn't want to take him to like um anywhere to go get his haircut or anything so he may reach the three month mark and he's getting really close to the three month mark so i am going to be taking him he has an appointment on june the 13th to go get um to go get his fur trimmed and his nails trimmed and all that good stuff and yes i will be standing there watching them like a hawk till they finish my baby because you will treat him right at all times and what no one told me was this is like having a baby. He is a baby. He wakes up two times a night to eat. He likes to sleep under us, like really like under us. He has his pillow in between me and my husband because he leaks, literally sleeps under us. No, not in between us because I'm scared we're going to smush him. But he sleeps at the head of the bed on his own personal pillow. And what else? Um, Potty training. Potty training has been an adventure just because he'll poop on the training pads, but then he has his days where he wants to poop on my floor. Thank God for tile floors because this would be a travesty. And I wanted to put a carpet rug in my room and I will not be doing that anytime soon until he is trained on the puppy pads because we don't have a backyard and even if we had a backyard he's way too little to go outside he's the type of dog like the veterinary said a hawk can come swoop down and get him and take him and eat him so he wouldn't be outside anyway he's going to definitely be a house dog but um he needs to be able to use the bathroom and be trained to use the bathroom so you're gonna say bye tokyo hey boy hey boy mm-hmm so yeah, I'm gonna get him off the camera because I know he's ready to eat and he look he acting sleepy. I know he's ready to eat and use the bathroom. Y'all, he's so adorable. I'm in love. Like I didn't want no baby babies because she don't do babies, okay? You probably like kids, but you got three kids. Yes, I do. But I don't like kids like that. I love my kids, but I don't like kids like that. Which is crazy because I be saying I don't like kids like that. But let, let me see a child crying or let me see a child needing something. I'm there. Okay, so let me rephrase that because I'm not going to say I don't like kids. I don't like babies. Okay, see that sound bad too because when I see other people's babies, I want to hold them. Okay, I don't like babies for myself because I need to be able to give you your baby back. I don't want to wake up with no babies. I don't want to take care of no babies. I don't want to do nothing for no babies, okay? I want to be able to give you your baby. I babysit your baby, but I need you to come pick your baby up. <sighs> but yeah, I know I ain't want no more kid kids because she living her best life. We finna get out of here. Tokyo, say bye. Okay, his left, that, that, that right ear went up, so I'm assuming he's saying bye. So we gonna say bye.